Oh, that's not good. Yep, I died. It should have auto saved while I was on the. Wow, that was actually hard. Um, I should have auto saved while I was on the uh, elevator. So I should be fine. Should, 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 should. Cross your fingers. Um, nope. I'm a liar. Really? Stupid. Whoa. That was. Was that supposed to happen? There are secrets here that were meant to be forgotten. I who? I who? But yeah, um, on every main mission, you probably noticed this. I, I think I did at least a few times. They have different dialogue options to say, so that's interesting. So like, let's see. This place feels wrong to me. Things like that. Again. Of course you do. So much do you said that already? So the same thing. Essentially the same thing. I'm the wrong one. I only hope I have the chance to come back someday. Whoa, that was glitched. That was weird. Toodaloo. And here's the place. Well, okay. Focusing on one works well. Better. Or you can just do that. Still focusing one at a time, though. Alright, that's it. One more. Where is he? There he is. Sweet. I didn't even do that on purpose. Quick save, quick save, quick save. Negative save. contacts. Quick save. Thank you, Gears. There are secrets here that Okay, you said they're already. And they only have like three and then they start repeating. And I think getting off the close to the half hour mark, aren't I? Oh well. I don't really care. Hey guys doing good. This place still has power. It must be running off its own channel. Said that last time, Garris. This must be the command center for the entire complex. Saren's troops must have sealed the doors from here after we went inside. We will have to figure out okay. how to disengage the security lockdown if we ever want to get inside that bunker. Okay. Thanks for the information, Leon. And let's see this. It should have more raw damage. Can they see me? I don't think they know I'm here yet. Wow, my shields. I've lost shields! And there went Liar. Powering up! Wait, level up again? I've lost shields! There's no cover there. Oh god. I'm screwed, I'm screwed, I'm screwed. Yep. This is actually gonna be hard. Okay, new tactic. Um, take down his shields and then fling him into the air and then shoot him to death. Or kill everything else first, that works too. Also, ditch the assault rifle. And here we are. And find some better cover. So lots of things. Get down. Thank you. I've lost shields. Got one. I've lost shields. Got that one. I love how they're just lining up for me to... Where's the... Okay, there he is. Get up! You idiot. Um... Lift. No. Oh god. Come on, don't die. Oh. Die, die, die. Got it. And Metagel, and I am totally fine now. So that was actually a little difficult. Anything left? No? Sweet.
Okay, thank you for that information. Dang it. <sighs> Hard one experience is nothing. There's more than one here. Where's there's one? So really you just need to look for the best way to start going in from. And that makes that quite a bit easier instead of just wow. Miss so many. Instead of just trying to do it from uh, wherever you start. Just take a second to look around and look where's best. And then just pay attention. What? I'm gonna miss another one. Uh but I have like 200 on jail, so not a big deal. I think they may help you fight. I'm not positive. Because it's really hard to get to them. Hard to create. Where? where? Ah. Toodly doo, toodly doo. Because now it's been half an hour, but I've only got like 10, 15 minutes left of stuff here. So I'm just gonna be like, whatever. And do it. So it's gonna be an extra long episode. God. Wow. So I'm jumping to Jogon. Because I had 200. Anyways, up we go. And. Security panel, open. Come, Saren already has a head start. We have to go find him before he reaches the conduit. Obviously. Unless he's already found it, then we're just walking into a trap. That is a chance we will have to take. Hold on. Something's happening. <laughs> Too late. Unable to invading fleets. Eh, I changed my mind. No I think I will stop. Sounds like some kind of message, but I don't recognize the language. And then I'll it is probably it. in Prothean. This recording must be fifty thousand okay, years okay, old. Okay. No wonder we cannot understand it. What? You can the understand message it? Message is all I broken up, it. but I recognize some Yay, of the words. Cipher. It's a warning against the Reaper invasion. Of course. Between the beacons and the cipher, I don't an understanding of the Prothean language this. would have been transferred into your any mind. Decent amount, we'll stop. Not safe. Seek refuge. Inside the archives. What's it say? Can you make out anything useful? Uh, archives. Fought Reapers. The Citadel. Overwhelmed. So it must like integrate the cipher with your own experiences, because then the Citadel. What they called it probably didn't even be so, you know, That's just what we call it. Call the conduit. It. All is lost. It said something about the conduit, act, though. but it's too degraded to help. We should, we should go. go. Hmm. It cannot be stopped. It cannot be stopped. That's good to know. Anything up here? Wow, there's nothing up here. Fantastic. So yeah, there wasn't anything significant there, so let's continue. We'll get a plot dump later. And then I have to decide whether to call this episode Plot Dump or this. <laughs> Ilos. It's normally the first episode on a planet I named it after the planet. But I think I'll name this one Plot Dump because there's a serious plot dump coming. Yay, elevators! Hey, this one's going up. Sweet. Oh yeah, because we opened up the... Yeah. So we need to go back up to get into the Mako to continue on. That's right. So the rest of this episode is going to be in the Mako. So if you like the Mako, yay. If you don't, well, too bad. Suck it up. There'll be more non-Mako soon. This place does look pretty cool, though. I mean, look at that. Giant freaking pillars. Are those like skyscrapers or something? Curious. Covered with massive, massive plants. Mako! And then it just randomly opens when I'm not even close yet. Anyways, time we go. So, yeah, tunnel. I have spent cool my life tunnel. studying the Protheans, but I never dreamed I would discover anything like this. 
What was this originally? This bunker might have been the last refuge of their entire species. I mean, it species. can't have been meant to be Just imagine the last what refuge of their entire hold. species. Imagine what secrets it might reveal. I guess we'll see. Hey, huh. try to remember why we're here. Saren, the conduit, the fate of the entire known galaxy. <laughs> I am sorry. I was swept up in the moment. I just hope we have the opportunity to... What are all those things on the wall? Some kind nice of Nice job, Garrus. I guess they I drive like too fast. stasis pods. The Protheans probably tried to keep themselves alive through... Did she get interrupted too? Got one. Eh. What? Don't load while a rocket's being shot at me. Skip this. Did it skip frame? Is there another one? Nope. My <laughs> that one. That's some air time. I don't think I ever did any spectacular jumps in this playthrough, did I? I did some decent ones. But I wasn't on enough planets with enough crazy cliffs. Well, they all have crazy cliffs. But not really, really, really crazy cliffs. I'm rambling. Oh, look. A shield. What does this mean? Crash. What is happening? Oh. It's a trap. Saren must have said it's a hatch. trap. I do not think Saren is behind this. I was too few, Liara. Garrus, do you know who Admiral Akbar is? I mean, I'm just curious. No? Okay. I have studied the Protheans for decades, but I have never felt this. Why so quiet, Liara? What will we find down there? Whatever it is, we should be careful. You too, Garrus. Sheesh. Oh, this looks pretty sweet. Quick save just for fun. Vigil. Hmm. Interesting. Hi. You are not Prothean, but you are not machine either. This eventually was dumb. one of many that was anticipated. This is why we sent our warning through the beacons. Those who came before. Looks like some kind of VI program. Pretty badly damaged. Obviously. I do not sense the taint of indoctrination upon any of you. Unlike the other that passed recently, perhaps there is still hope. This is incredible. An actual Prothean VI, and I can understand it. I have been monitoring your communication since you arrived at this facility. I have translated my output into a format you will comprehend. So does he mean since we, like, dropped my name is Vigil. Because we only said, like, four sentences since we came into the But that is likely to change. Soon, nowhere will be safe. Because of the Reapers? Are you some kind of artificial intelligence program? I am an advanced non-organic analysis system with personality imprints from Kesad Aishan, chief overseer of the Ilos Research Facility. Cool. Get to the point, though. Why did you bring me here? You must break a cycle that has continued for millions of years. But to stop it, you must understand. Or you will make the same mistakes we did. Like trying to fight the completely overpowering. The Citadel is the heart of your civilization force. and the seat of government. As it was with us, True. and Out. as it has been with every civilization that force. came before us. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. But the Citadel Official. is a trap. The Another station trap is scene. actually an enormous mass relay. One that links to dark space, the empty that void be beyond good. the galaxy's horizon. When the Citadel relay is activated. The Reapers will pour through, and all you know will be destroyed. That doesn't sound good. How come nobody ever noticed the Citadel noticed. was an inactive mass? Because we have no idea how The Reapers are work. careful to That's keep why. the greatest secrets of the Citadel hidden. That is why they created a species of seemingly benign organic caretakers. Mm. The, keepers. the Keepers maintain the station's most basic functions. They enable any there is species no way that discovers the Citadel the to use it without possible. fully understanding the technology. Reliance on the Keepers ensures no other species will ever discover the Citadel's true nature. Hmm. Not until the relay is activated and the Reapers invade. And then everyone's like, oh no, we're gonna die. How do the Reapers survive? They're the machines. We have only theories. The researchers here came to believe the Reapers enter prolonged states of inactivity to conserve energy. This allows them to survive the thousands and thousands of years it takes for organic civilization to rebuild itself. But in this state, they are vulnerable. Oh 
know. By retreating beyond the edges of the food. galaxy, yeah. they ensure no one will accidentally get discover out there them. Because we have to use they the keep their relays. existence hidden until the Citadel relay is activated. The Reapers can wipe out the Council and the entire Citadel fleet in a single surprise attack. No, that duh. was our fate. Our leaders were dead before we even realized we were under attack. The Reapers seized control of the Citadel, and through it, the mass relays. Communication and transportation this across our empire were crippled. The main gist of it is pretty Each simple. star system was isolated, it. cut off from the we others. Got a little more to go, though. Easy prey for the Reaper I think fleets. there's another set of questions. Over the next decades, what, the 10, Reapers systematically over. obliterated our people. World by world, decades. system by system, That's point. they methodically decades. wiped us out. Some of you must have managed to survive. Through the Citadel, the Reapers had access to all our records, maps, census data. Information is power, and they knew everything about us. So what would happen if their fleets advanced just across every single region the of the galaxy? Some Surely worlds were happened. utterly destroyed. I mean, come on. Others were uh, conquered. Their were populations the people, enslaved. Right? Unlike the council races. These indoctrinated so servants became sleeper a, agents under Reaper control. Middle taken ground in as refugees as, by uh, other Protheans. Uh, they really betrayed them to the think machines. The Prothean Empire would have been ruled from the Prothean planet, Within right? a few centuries, the Reapers had killed or enslaved every yeah, Prothean really in the galaxy. It's just Reapers are bad, they kill everyone, blah, 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 absolutely blah, blah, blah. thorough. What do the Reapers get out of this? Why do they keep repeating this pattern of genocide over and over? The Reapers are alien, unknowable. That's what Summer Perhaps said. they need slaves or resources. More likely they are driven by motives and goals organic and beings cannot hope to the comprehend. The first one makes the Reapers seem really, really mysterious. In the end, what does it matter? Your survival depends on stopping time. them, not in understanding them. How? You said you brought me here for a reason. Tell me what I need to do. The conduit is the key. Before the Reapers attacked, we Protheans were on the cusp of unlocking the mysteries behind can, can mass relay research, technology. Please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Then we make our own. was a top secret you, facility. Here, researchers worked to create a small-scale version of a mass relay. One that linked directly to the Citadel, the hub of the relay network. The conduit is not a weapon. It is a backdoor onto the Citadel. What happened they next? Made the we severed all communication with the outside. Mm -hmm. And our facility so went dark. Why can't we study the personnel the retreated underground into these archives. To conserve resources, everyone yeah, was put into cryogenic stasis. I was programmed to monitor the facility and wake the staff when the danger had passed. Unfortunately, but the genocide of an entire species is a long, slow process. Years passed, decades, centuries. Did they never the find Reapers persisted, and my Secret energy reserves were dwindling. How did you survive? I began to disable the life support of non-essential personnel. First support staff, then security. One by one, their pods were shut down to conserve energy. Brutal. Eventually, only the stasis pods of the top scientists remained active. Even these were in danger of failing when the Reapers finally retreated back through the Citadel relay. Wait, so some of there them There were survived? hundreds of stasis pods out there. You just shut them down? You killed them? You I couldn't let everyone die. Necessary. Better to sacrifice some so others could live. This outcome was not completely unforeseen. My actions were a result of contingency programming entered on my creation. I bet they didn't tell the non-essential staff about this contingency. I saved key personnel. When the Reapers retreated, the top researchers were still alive. My actions are the only reason any hope remains. When the researchers woke, they realized the Prothean species was doomed. Otherwise they there were only a dozen good. individuals left, far too few to sustain a viable population. Yeah, the actual numbers, actually, it's actually only like Yet they vowed to find some way to stop the Reapers from returning. But a way to break yeah, the cycle forever. And they knew the Keepers were the key. The Keepers? Aren't they under the influence of the Reapers? Kind the of Keepers sort of. are controlled by the Citadel. Wait, Before each invasion, a signal is sent through the station compelling the Keepers to activate the Citadel relay. After decades of feverish study, the scientists discovered a way to alter this signal. So Using the conduit, they, they gained access the conduit, to the Citadel and made the, the modifications. Keepers. What else did they do? 
this time, when Sovereign sent the signal to the Citadel, the Keepers did. ignored it. The Reapers are trapped in dark space. Saren can dun, use the dun, conduit dun. to bypass all the Citadel's external defenses. Correct. And once inside, he can transfer control of the station to Sovereign. Not a Sovereign good thing. will override the Citadel systems and manually Where open is the Sovereign relay. Right now? Is he still on and the cycle of extinction will begin again. I'll take Sovereign down. Somehow. At least you have the There's qualifier There's a data this file time. in my console. Take a copy when you go. When you reach the Citadel's master control unit, upload it to the station. It will corrupt the Citadel's security protocols and give you temporary control of the station. It might give you a chance against Sovereign. Wait, where's the Citadel's master control unit? Obviously there's one somewhere, Garrison. Through the conduit. Follow Saren. He will lead you to your destination. If the Sovereign. Reapers are trapped in dark space, how did Sovereign get here? It is logical to assume the Reapers would leave one of their own behind after each extinction. A sentinel to pave the way for their inevitable return. Like those in dark space, Sovereign probably spent most of the last 50,000 years in a state of hibernation. Periodically, it would wake to analyze the situation. Keeping its existence hidden, and it, decided it now would evaluate the, the state of galactic civilization. And when the time was right, it would signal the Citadel and usher in the next Reaper invasion. So the Protheans ended up sacrificing But this time the signal failed. The, the Keepers did not respond. Sovereign's allies were trapped in the void. Alone, it was forced to try and discover what had gone wrong. And it did. What about the beacon on Eden Prime? And the one on Vermeer? What were they for? At our apex, the beacons spanned the breadth of our empire. We used them as a single galaxy-wide network to transmit data and communications rapidly from world to world. Sweet. Virtually all the beacons were destroyed during the invasion. But once the Reapers were gone, the survivors here on Ilos decided to risk sending out a message. We knew it was unlikely there were other survivors. But if there were, we wanted them to know about Ilos. We wanted to give them hope. So a message was sent across the network. You could have exposed yourself to the but Reapers. they were gone, remember? In truth, we didn't expect any of the beacons would still function. But we had to try. I don't think the Reapers if there were survivors, like we had to reach them. The message was meant for our own people. It was coded so only organic beings could interpret it. We still didn't understand the power of Reaper So yeah, this may be like the longest conversation in the entire we game. We never realized it could lead an agent of the Huge machines plot, like Saren to this world. But it has also led you here. So and perhaps we did not fail after all. Yeah, I'm good now. Saren's got enough of a head start. Grab that data file and let's go. Shepard, are you sure? Who knows how much longer Vigil will be here? Even now the projection is weak. This might be our only chance to speak with it, our only link to the knowledge of the Protheans. It is the opportunity of a lifetime. We're in a race to save the galaxy and you want to play yeah. QA with a hologram? You are right. I am sorry. My personal feelings clouded despite my Despite the judgment. fact that if you actually do talk to him more, we, it doesn't actually make any difference. Despite go. the fact that it's... The one you call Saren has pretty, not reached the continent. You know much time. Not yet. Oh, there is shoot. still hope if you hurry. I need to do this because it's timed, I think. No, it's not timed. Okay, there's a time part though. Um, so that's gonna be it for this episode. And it's, uh, what about 15 minutes? That's long. Um, I think I'm gonna finish and then split it in two. And that'll be enough for the rest of the week. And then I'll finish next week. Why so quiet? Yeah. So yeah, I'll split it in two. So you're not gonna get your nice, uh, ending to the first one. Ooh, this one, though. Or the beginning. Darn, I'll have to put in the annotations. It does fall to us, doesn't it? So yeah, I'm just gonna go find the conduit and go through, and that'll, that'll be it for this episode, which is going to be 58, actually. Down we go. Oh god. Whoa, I killed three in one shot. That was impressive. Yeah, I know Liara. I one-shotted them all. 
For a second I thought I got to make him stuck. I was like, what? That doesn't happen. Eee, what the heck? That was weird. I don't know what the Mako's made out of to bounce like that. Such a wonky physics engine. Anybody down there? Wow, this place is big. Hmm, anybody? Don't see anybody? There's people here. Let's see. Fiddle do. Hey okay, there. You're dead. And oh god. You're dead. Was that four in one shot or just three? Oh, he's not even dead. Die. Whatever. Oh, that's a Colossus. I could just skip it. Because they have so much health. What I'll probably do is get out and snipe it right at the end. Because you get a lot more experience if you kill something. Oops, I got hit. If you kill something while you're not in the Mako, than if you kill it with the Mako. The Mako has this giant cannon. See, 1,500. That's significant. It'll do. Racing through Ilos. What? I still want to know. Is this a sewer? A river? Like an aqueduct kind of thing? What is this? I'm curious. I do not understand the purpose of this area. Of course, there's a lot of areas like that, but really. Something stretch imagination. What? Oh, they didn't kill him? Well, that did. Perimeter secured. Well, how did that hit? Whatever. What? Because it failed? Why? Oh. Man, go straight. Thank you. Oh, something shot at me. Getting low on shields. Hey, stupid Mako. Let me just get to shoot a bunch of Geth and then we're done. Almost done, almost done. Two more episodes. I think it'll be two. I wonder what that is. There, the conduit. It's incredible. Yeah, this is a pretty we impressive don't have time shot, to I have to say. View. We have to get through that relay, and these Geth aren't going to make it easy on us. Yeah, you don't, you don't kill stuff here, because this is, this is when it gets timed randomly all of a sudden oh cutscene I forgot about this sovereign look at how big he is compared to those dreadnoughts those things are big too sovereign is huge two kilometers which makes those dreadnoughts look small look not that big actually or maybe a tenth the size oh 200 meters is still a lot it's not that much no why aren't your barriers up That's a weird looking ship. I wonder what they pull for. Is that a docking base or sort? Activate the defenses. Seal the station. The arms aren't moving. Systems not responding. Abandon the Citadel. Evacuate the Council. Citadel Control. Citadel Control. Do you copy? Oh no. It's a Geth. And that was Saren. 36, 35, 34. So why were we stopped during the cutscene? Or were we watching too? I wonder what this music is. So yeah, those are uh, Colossi. You don't have remotely enough time to kill one of them, let alone both. And it's very possible to die. I forgot about that. Run, 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 run. Faster, faster, faster. Don't die, don't die, don't die. I'm really close if you look in the bottom right. And really. Really, I'm halfway up the ramp. Why isn't it rolling backwards? That was stupid. So let's try not to do the 
Wait, where am I? Really? It's not going to go through the cutscene again, is it? Or... Is it? There, the you said that. Really? It's incredible. You're going to repeat this? We don't have time to admire the view. Can we I skip the cutscene? that relay, and these geth aren't going to make it easy on us. Skip, 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 skip. Skip, skip. No? No skip. No skip. So you get to see the cool cutscene again. I, um, I guess as a punishment. I guess it is, actually. Because I get to see how tiny those ships are again. These two kilometers, and they're a twentieth of that. Or a fifteenth of that. They're not much more than a football field. Which means they're smaller than an aircraft carrier. Or about the size of an aircraft carrier. Which... I guess that's reasonable. Uh, sorry. You know, I never really heard about moving. those tattoos Systems on the face or whatever they are. They don't all have them. But I don't know what the they're Citadel. for. Evacuate the council. Citadel control. Citadel control. Do you copy? Oh no! That must be Citadel control, and that's a Geth in Saren. He's using a Geth pulse rifle. I'm surprised he doesn't have his own favorite weapon that he continued to use. So let's try not to die this time. Fall the river. That was close. I have shields this time, though. Ow! Direct hit! Direct hit! The only reason I died last time was because my shields were really low. And... The Mako just got shot through space. Which is kind of cool. Wait, what would have happened if we were facing the wrong way? Would we turn around? Critical failures detected if we weren't facing, like, right at the systems. citadel. Yeah. You remember the statue that looked like a relay? Yeah, it actually is a relay. Oh look, death. And that crashed the Mako. It did just go through a relay, so it's understandable. But yeah. And uh, that's gonna be it. Uh, thank you for watching this episode. Like it if you liked it. Comment if you have anything to say. Subscribe if you haven't. And all that good stuff. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Where we finish. And then I can start Mass Effect 2 next week. Or week after next. Yeah. After we finish. The week after we finish. Thanks for watching. See ya.